Hi, this is Chris Gould with Geeks on Tour, also known as Geeks Who Teach. Now, I know you've been hearing an awful lot about artificial intelligence chatbots. There's currently three of them, ChatGPT, three main ones, ChatGPT, Microsoft Bing Chat, and Google Bard. I want to make sure you just know how to get to them and ask a question. Let me show you how. On a computer, you just go to any browser, and it is chat.openai.com. There are other versions of this, but if you just go to chat.openai.com, you are getting ChatGPT version 3, and it is completely free. Now, the first time you go here, you have to make an account you'll see this screen that says log in or sign up. If you choose sign up, this is the first time you've ever been here, and you have a Google account, you can just continue with Google. That's what I did. I did not want to make another account with another password on the web. I just continued with Google. So you can see on this screen, it knows that I am Chris Gould. Now, this is the screen you see. You click right here and type your question. We have to relearn how to write our questions. This is a chatbot. You want to chat with it. In Google searches, we've learned to be very short and concise. In chats, you need to be a little bit more conversational. So here is my question. I want to write a book about RVing in the USA. Give it some background. Please be polite. Give me seven chapter titles. Be specific to cover the topic. And then you click this little arrow and it will start working on it. Here are the seven chapter titles plus a description of the chapter. I didn't even ask it for that. This is I think this is pretty cool. It might not be the exact chapters I end up with, but it's great for giving you a starting point. Now, how about Google's Bard? That is their chat bot. You go to any web browser and it's bard.google.com. I'm going to ask it the same question. Just as with ChatGPT, you do need to have an account, but my browser, my Chrome browser, is always signed in to my Google account. So I'm right here, and it is completely free. Just type your question and click the arrow. And it did the same thing. It gave me seven chapter titles. They're different chapter titles than ChatGPT gave me. But it also gives me a description, even though I didn't ask for that. And the last one I want to show you is Microsoft's offering, which is Bing Chat. Although you can go to bing.com using the Chrome browser, if you want to chat, and that's this button up here, it's going to tell you that you need to open the Microsoft Edge browser instead. I could click right here, but I just I want to show you down on my toolbar, I do have Microsoft Edge installed. It is a browser from Microsoft, and its icon looks like a wave. So I'll click that. And here I am at the Microsoft Edge browser. There is a Bing chat button in the upper right, but I want to go to the full screen. So I'm going to click on the address bar and go to bing.com. Then there is this chat button in the top. Click chat. Now you are talking to the AI. Once again, you do need to be signed in with your Microsoft account. I can see that I am, and here is where you ask your question. I'm just going to paste in the same question that I asked the other two. I want to write a book about RVing in the USA. Please give me seven chapter titles to cover the topic. Click the arrow. 
and it starts writing. One more thing you can ask Bing Chat to do is to draw for you, to give you graphics. I guess it didn't want to give me a good title. <laughs> Uh, you can keep asking it for adjustments to these, but that's all I'm going to show you for now. So those are the three main chatbots today. ChatGPT, Google Bard, and Microsoft Bing Chat, and how to access them on the computer. You can do the same thing on a phone. Have fun chatting.